Hi guys, I'm Ayush and you're watching my channel Dibbly Dobbly. It's time to suggest some of the best players that you can look to pick for your Dream 11 team for the Australia vs Bangladesh game to be played at Trent Bridge. Historically speaking, Australia vs Bangladesh has been quite a one-sided affair. Bangladesh has defeated Australia only once in all these years of playing ODIs and that too was 14 years ago in 2005. But this is not the Bangladesh of the past. They've improved a lot, matured a lot in the last two years and this World Cup after a win against South Africa and an epic chase against West Indies, they have a realistic chance of making to the top four. Australia on the other hand, they have eight points already in the points table but they have looked a, not their best against teams like Sri Lanka, Pakistan and West Indies. If Bangladesh can surprise Australia tomorrow, the race to the top four might get a bit more interesting. This match will be played at Trent Bridge, a ground which is famous for its flat deck and small boundaries. Hence, we can expect a lot of runs from both the teams. There has been some rains in the past. This is the ground where actually the India vs New Zealand match was recently washed out. But this match day is clear and we should have a full game. Coming to the list of players that you can select for your Dream 11 team from this match, here is my suggested list. From the wicket keepers, I've gone for two from Bangladesh. The experienced Mushfikur Rahim and Litin Das who played a tremendous innings in the last match against West Indies. From the batsmen, I've gone for the top three from Australia because I expect a lot of runs on this pitch. The captain Aaron Finch, David Warner and Usman Khwaja. Usman Khwaja hasn't scored a lot of runs in this World Cup till now but I suspect he'll get another chance in this game and because he'll bat higher, there is a higher probability of him scoring good runs. If you still don't see Usman Khwaja in the final 11, you can go for Sean Marsh instead. From Bangladesh, I've gone for their dashing opener, Swami Sarkar. Among the all-rounders, it's a no-brainer. You have to select Shakib Hassan, who's been the player of the tournament till now. And I've gone for Glenn Maxwell, who should be able to play the Bangladeshi spinners well. Coming to the list of bowlers, I've gone for pace from Australia. Stark and Cummins are obvious choice, while other fast bowler Australia pick, which should surely be someone like Kane Richardson. From Bangladesh, I've gone for the lone spinner, Mehdi Hassan, because I feel if Bangladesh is to do well in this match against Australia, then the spinners would play a key role. For the captain of the team, it will be safest to go for Shakib Hassan. He'll bat at number three, he'll also bowl 10 overs, so you get that double chance of making some good points. As the vice captain of the team, I've gone for David Warner from Australia because I feel he's a better player of spin than Aaron Finch. Also, Warner would have played Shakib Hassan a considerable amount of time in the nets at Sunrisers Hyderabad and hence he should know how to handle him. For a couple of surprise picks, I'm still looking out to see if Australia picks Nathan Lyon for this game, especially because Bangladesh has a considerable amount of lefties in its top order. If he does play, then he can be a good pick for the Dream 11 team. And then from Bangladesh, you can go for a pacer like Saifuddin. Saifuddin bowled well in the last match also. And because he'll bowl at the dead, there is a good chance that he'll get some handy wickets. So here's my final list of players for this Bangladesh versus Australia game. I expect it to be an exciting contest, specifically because I could see the hunger in Bangladesh in that game against West Indies, especially in their fielding. If they can bring that level of intensity in this game against Australia, I think they'll have more than a chance. That's it from me for Dream 11. If you like my suggestions, please follow my channel, Dibbly Dobbly. Thanks a lot.